With Emblem Corin added to our ranks, each country's rings have been collected. All right. No more rings in the wild. Between us and Sombron, they've all been taken. Let's consider the situation. There are five emblems on our side. Lynn, Lucina, Ike, Byleth, and now Corin. Meanwhile, the Fell Dragon's got seven in his grubby claws. Most of them are old allies. Marth, Sigurd, Selica, Micaiah, Leaf, and Roy. As well as another emblem ring his forces stole from Lethos, the Azure Twins. To gather all twelve, we will need to face the enemy directly. Are you proposing we invade Illusia? Returning to Illusia already? Yeah, that's gotta be complicated. Indeed. But, that aside, invading Illusia now would be a mistake. They have a clear advantage. Seven emblems to our five. The worst case scenario is that they steal more of our rings. That's what concerns me. If that happens, we can abandon all hope of defeating the Fell Dragon. But the longer we wait to attack, the more likely it is they'll attack us. It's best that we strike first. One never wants to be on the wrong end of an ambush. But we're not ready to take the offensive. Rock in a hard place, huh? Pardon the interruption. Vander, what is it? Word from the Port of Solm. A number of warships were spotted on the horizon. Judging from the crests on their sails, they appear to be Illusion vessels. They're attacking the Queendom again? No. In fact, the fleet sails toward Firinair. My kingdom. We'd better take a look for ourselves. Let's head to the Azure Coast. It's near the border, and it's got a clear view of the sea. <laughs> Smooth sailing. At this rate, we'll be the first ones in Firinae. It would seem so. Wonder why Zephia told us to go ahead. Our orders are to kill everyone we see, right? With this kind of head start, think of the body count we can get. We'll be heroes! Seems like Zephia's really taken a shine to us. Don't you think, Mavir? I do not particularly care. I have my orders, and I will follow them. <sighs> see, this is why I can't stand you. You never praise me, and you're no fun at all. I thought Chris was bad. At least he's not the boringest man in the world. <sighs> Lady Marnie, Sir Mavir. You got something to report? Two soldiers have deserted the fleet. Hmm. Perhaps they had reservations about the current strategy. Whatever. Leave them be. We'll catch up later and beat the daylights out of them. Uh, but they took an emblem ring. What?! Explain. As a precaution, we kept each ring on a separate ship in the fleet. These soldiers attacked the guard on watch and stole the ring of the Azure Twins. Warships are already in pursuit. We will take chase as well. The ring must be returned at any cost. These soldiers, what are their names? Rosado and Goldmary. Princess Hortensia's retainers? I thought those two were behaving themselves lately. No longer, it seems. Do we know where they went? They were headed to Solm by Wyvern. All right. Turn this ship around. Take us to the coast of Solm. Ugh. And we were in the lead. Those two are in heaps of trouble. What do you know? They're going to hand deliver us another emblem ring. We're in Solm now. I think it's safe to say we lost them. Perhaps we should pause for a moment then. I'm sure your wyvern needs to rest her wings. Good idea. Let's take a breather and then start looking for Hortensia. We have to make sure she gets the ring of the Azure Twins. Indeed. Aha! There they are! Let's seize them! Is a few minutes rest really too much to ask? Let's get out of here, Goldmary. That's an Illusion fleet, all right. And it does look to be headed toward Firinae. We have to get there before they do. That'd be nice, but look. We've got Illusion soldiers on the beach. 
You want to attack again, huh? I'll give you a good old-fashioned Solmic welcome. That's not enough troops for an invasion. It looks more like a search party. Divine One! There's a Wyvern coming this way! They must have spotted us. Everyone, at the ready! Hold on! Rosado? Gold Mary! <laughs> yeah, there's the retainers. New emblem rings, let's go! Hortensia! You're not hurt, are you? I was so worried. Not as worried as I was! Oh, I'm so happy you two are alive! Nice to see you and your retainers back together again. The Divine Dragon! Watch out! Put that away, Rosado! I'm on the Divine Dragon's side now! My sister is too! Princess Ivy as well? Psst! If you're being held against your will, blink three times! I swear, it's not like that. I wanted to join them, so I did. I made this choice for Illusia. Question is, as my retainers and my friends, will you join me? All right. If this is what you want, then it's what I want too. Whatever banner you're under, I will defend it with all my might. Good. I knew I could count on you two. Um, Divine One, sorry for drawing my weapon on you. Here, this is yours. Is this... The Ring of the Azure Twins. We stole it from the ship we were on. Thank you. Good going! <laughs> I hope my dazzling abilities do not blind you. This is just what we needed. Restore Calm. Emblem of the Sacred. It's Emperor and, um... Ericon Emperor! Yes! Finally, I am returned to your side. My name is Erika. I raise my sword in hopes that peace will come to this world at last. I know we can depend on you, Erika. Now, which of you should I give this ring to? You're both to thank for bringing it here. You ought to give it to Rosado. Rosado flew us here. He was instrumental in our escape. You were too, Gold Mary. But there's no time to argue, is there? Lend me the ring and I promise, I'll do my part. It's settled. Here you are, Rosado. Finally! This is where those thieves ran off to, right? By all accounts, yes. Now, we sniff them out. Well, yeah. <laughs> We have to uh, evade some uh, capture. Welcome back, everybody, to Fire Emblem Engage. It's your boy, Mr. Soap999, and today we are going to be taking on Chapter 16. What well, was supposed to have been a nice, relaxing beach party ended up turning into this. Hey, let's go. He joined our group. More wyverns. Moments ago, the beach was dry, and now the water is up to my ankles. The tide here seems to rise and fall at a moment's notice. Try to keep me on dry land, will you? Ugh, I'd hate to be stuck tromping around in the water. Yeah, who wouldn't? Makes you all wet. Anyway, where are you? There you are. All right. Nice. Oh yeah, I gave myself Emblem Corwin. Lend me your strength. Barefoot dragon waifu foot jobs all day, boys. Let's go. No, uh, never mind. Okay, so the water comes up every now and then. Doesn't look like that was be much of a problem. However, this guy over here is needs to go. My pleasure. Yeah, take care of him. I will protect everyone! 
death. Thank you for the dance. Our side's cuter for sure, but by the looks of it, theirs might be tougher. Worry not, Rosado. With my power, you can punch through even the hardiest foe's defenses. You may also call upon my twin brother's abilities if you like. Emblem Erica switches with her twin brother to adapt to a different situation. The Sync Skill Lunar Brace increases damage dealt in proportion to the foe's defense. The engaged weapon Rapier Deer deals more <laughs> bonus damage against cavalry and armored foes. Sacred Twins enables the unit to invoke both of the twins simultaneously. Oh, that's cool. Alright. Uh. Well, let's go! That's a crit! Dead. No one desires war. Oh, come on, really? Yes! 18 hit rate! Yeah! Okay, now we can finally move again. Oh, hello there. Let's let's kill him first. I have to keep everyone safe. How you doing? Everybody else can just go right here. I'm just gonna make a beeline straight over here. Take care of these guys real quickly. These guys are about to have a bad time. <laughs> Guess I did it right. Yeah, they're about to have a really bad time. I've decided. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, boy. Dog. Dog attack. That was a cinch. Doggo attack. Yeah. Oh, come on. <laughs> that's that's kind of funny. She's just vibing. She gets hit once. <laughs> oh, that's a crit. Bam. Alright, yeah, take him out. Yeah. Get rid of him. Oh, you he's dead. Dead. That's what you get, bitch. Let's go. Alright, yeah, I hope everybody's having a good time here today. And hopefully, uh, if you're at the beach, your day is going better than these guys. Alrighty. The oh boy. Oh no, the tide! I mean, honestly, chapter 16 doesn't really seem that difficult. I see a spot over here. This house. We need to get to it. Ready yourself. That's a crit! <laughs> I am guided Yeah, by the let's go boys. Tide's coming back up. I mean the water is receding. Woo! Reinforcements! Too bad that they spawn when this guy is here. It's devil. Yeah! I am the divine dragon! That's another crack! I'm not afraid That's anymore. Death. Alright, Mavier is down here, and then so is Marnie. Ooh, Marnie's got a Master Seal. Exactly what I need! 
Oh, don't mind Yunaka, she's gonna dodge tank in this inside that little, little bush of grass. <laughs> I, I like how when you just stand in a little bush of grass, it just makes you harder to hit. Like, just standing in that grass, just... Oh! I cannot be hit! Yippee! Ugh. Do it! Now I have you! A good win! Stab the corrupted worm! What? Really? That hit? Let's engage Envelope and make these two move again. Let the lesson begin! Alright. Let's see. Is it go time? Yeah, we'll have we'll have her move again. Yeah, go! On guard. These all these soldiers. They're like, hey, we we gotta we have to kill him! We have to kill him, or otherwise he's going to kill us! Too bad they don't realize they're already dead. I won't let anyone die. Uh, look at this guy over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, yeah. we'll take him out here. Let's see. What is our weapon of choice to to amputate his life from? Here comes the femboy! Here comes the femboy! Death! Give it up. Oh, that's death! Why do we repeat our mistakes? Yeah, I saw those troops on the shore. Be careful, all right? And take this. Might help. Oh, yeah, that will help, all right. Thanks. Yeah! Huh? We came here to hunt a couple thieves. What are you punks doing here? Right! <laughs> <laughs> You're nothing! Nothing left of you. That's the former princess, man. What are you? What are you? What are you talking about, man? What, what are you doing, huh? I wonder if she has any dialogue with with uh, Gold Mary. Yeah, let, let's just see what the dialogue is. <laughs> gotcha, sticky fingers. Want to find out what I do to no good traitors? <laughs> no words. Okay. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> hey. All right. Well, take care of her. She's nothing. Oh, let's use the eleven knife. I mean, the eleven sword. By a bunch of weaklings. Fine. We'll call it even. Next time, though. You're dead. Super duper dead. <laughs> Yay. Alright, took care of that, eh? Yeah, let's use this. Yeah! Hmm. I should have guessed Hortensia's retainers would seek your forces out. Hey, let's go. Alright, we did we just gotta beat him up one more time. One more time here. This guy is oh No You missed That'll be fine. Doggo attack. Uh yeah. 
Here we go. <laughs> My path is certain. Yeah. Torrential roar. All right, that's it. Alas. I withdraw for now, but we will meet again. I can't fall here. I must make my retreat. The Illusion soldiers have fled. Marnie and Mavi are too. Now we can head to Firene. Yes, right away. If those ships made landfall, then my people are in danger. Ah, <sighs> that cool breeze. <laughs> Lovely, isn't it? Almost a shame we'll arrive in Firene soon. I'm surprised you came with us, Sepia. You're so loyal to Papa. I figured there was no way you'd approve of this. Oh? Well, your father is my master. But lately his orders have been somewhat concerning. I know exactly what you mean. He thinks nothing of killing people. I have the same blood in my veins, of course. Maybe it's natural people mistrust me. Oh, Lady Vale, no. I heard about those awful things the Divine Dragon said. That you killed Lumera? Stole the rings? If I were you, I wouldn't believe a word of it. After hearing who your father was, the Divine Dragon probably said that to hurt your feelings. Hmm. I've decided I won't harm anyone, ever. Even if it costs me my life. So, I'm not going back to Papa. I don't want to destroy this world. How kind-hearted of you. If you two really want to help, then after I've cleared up this misunderstanding, will you help me find my sibling? What a silly thing to say. You are Lord Sombron's only child. You have no brothers or sisters. That's not true. We've met. Look at this. How beautiful. It looks like a dragon stone. It is a dragon stone. A thousand years ago, I was crying, and one of my siblings gave it to me. I remember it well. Even though I can't stay with you, I'll always be your friend. If you're sad or lonely, remember, if this stone is intact, that means I'm still alive. As you can see, in all this time, it hasn't even cracked. But that means... What does that mean? It means my brother is still alive, and I'm going to find him. Perhaps with his help, I can convince Papa to end this horrible war. <sighs> Sophia, is something wrong? No, I'm just so... moved. After we've finished our business in Firene, Gris and I will help find your sibling. Thank you. I've been looking on my own this whole time. You two will be a big help. Look, Lady Vale. Firene on the horizon. Why don't you take in the view? Maybe reflect on what you'll say to patch things up? Good idea. <sighs> they know something. Especially Zephyr. Another one of Lord Sombron's children survived? First I'm hearing of it. I don't understand. They all perished in the war a thousand years ago. All of them except Lady Vale, who was too young to fight. I watched it happen, Gris. Watched as each and every one of them met their end. Unless... No. What? Remember something? It's only a hunch. But if I'm right, we may have a problem on our hands. Good thing we heard this before she fell asleep. Yes. After all, once we've gotten to Firene and uncovered the truth, she will never awaken again. And we're back home. <laughs> we're back here where we very first started our journey. We've... I think, yeah, we, we've gone all the way around the world. Damn. I'm pretty sure that this is going to be coming to an end soon. 
probably. Oh boy, well... I feel like we might have gotten some lore dump in this episode, but I think it was good. And we've also got the ring of... Emperor and... Um, I always mispronounce his name. Erica and her brother. Yeah. Yeah, we uh... We got, we got the ring of the two siblings from Sacred Stones. Amazing! Um, yeah, uh, that was, that's the end of this episode, everybody. Thank you for watching, and come back next time. Uh, next episode, chapter 17. I have a feeling we're about to see some uh, big story bombs, some lore bombs coming along the way, and I can't wait. If you guys enjoyed, <clears throat> if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like, comment, and subscribe, as I do various Nintendo games, as well as some various non-Nintendo games. I have done Fire Emblem. I have done all the Fire Emblem games on my channel, from Warriors, Three Houses, Hopes, and Engage. And I also do a little bit of Splatoon 3 every now and then. I also play Breath of the Wild. I am also very excited for Breath of the Wild 2. <laughs> I can't wait. My social media. I also have a series. I also have a series called Two Asian Best Friends Play Random Games Together and I hope you guys will enjoy it by checking it out. My social media links are in the description, be sure to check them out. And until the next episode everybody, stay fresh and have yourselves a damn good day.